Hey guys, Jordan Liberty here. Listen up for tips on these seriously glam Halloween looks using all Wet n Wild Fantasy Makers makeup. Okay, so to begin, I'm cutting out the butterfly skull stencil and applying it to the eye, filling in using the multi-sticks in orange and black. I use the black for the body, the orange for the wings, and then when I remove that stencil, I fill in those gaps with black as well. Embellishing using the black gems from the Cauldron Crew face and body gems to add a little bit of shine over the black. And then I'm using the orange glitter from the Horoscope glitter palette on top of the orange. Again, just to add a lot of shimmer. And for the other eye, I'm starting again with the Butterfly Skull Stencil, filling in with the black and orange multi-sticks as a base and layering over top with the coordinating black and orange shades from the Pick Your Poison Shadow Palette. Then I'm outlining the eye and the upper lash line using the glitter liner in Bat Your Eye, placing more gems around that eye, also from the Cauldron Crew face and body gems. And then I'm using that same glitter liner to create a dripping teardrop under the skull stencil to customize the look, finishing the eyes with false lashes in twilight for even more shimmer. I use the black paint pot to fill in the nose stencil, customizing the shape to my model's nose. And then for the teeth, I'm starting by applying the nude shade from the neutral paint palette over the lips and around the mouth so that when I place the teeth cut out from the stencil over top and fill in that stencil using the white paint pot, it creates a more three-dimensional effect on the teeth which I enhance by drawing lines between using the multi-stick in black. And then I'm finishing with the silver gems on top of the teeth from the face and body gems in Ghost Friends for Life. And that's it. Tag Wet n Wild Beauty and follow them on Instagram to enter their peekaboo contest and for a chance to be featured.